guys, so today is part one of my New York City haul. I decided um, since I got, I have gotten so many requests to do a New York haul, and of course I was going to do one. It just took me a couple days because, you know, I got back and I got, uh, yesterday was my first day back at school and then I had to get into, you know, like, school and getting back into everything, so um, I'm sorry that I've kept you guys waiting a couple days, but I am filming my haul today and I decided... Um, that I was going to do it in three parts because I did purchase a lot of things, but I knew I was going to purchase a lot of things. I mean, obviously, I was going to New York. I knew I was going on this trip, and I saved up my money. So I decided I was going to do clothing, accessories, and um, then beauty. Also, I apologize if my voice sounds different. I don't know if it does, but I am a little bit sick. I'm getting over um, a sickness, so if my voice sounds different, that's why. But um, anyway, so today's going to be the clothing part, and I do want to do a, like, a little disclaimer before I start this video. Um, so I am going to have the other parts up like throughout like the next week or so. I think I'm going to separate them with a couple other videos, just so it's not all together. But it's going to be three separate parts, so I'll link to those when those are up. But um, just know that those are coming and that this is just going to be part one. But I do have a disclaimer that um, you guys know that I went to New York and that I'm clearly, you know, a shopaholic. We all, we all know that here, okay? So um, I did buy a lot of things and I, you know, bought things that I want but not, don't necessarily need. But you know what? I love to shop and I make my own money and I can do what I want with my own money and I feel like you guys can all understand that if you make your own money, you know, you spend it on what you want and you save it for what you want. So um, that's what I do. I save for things and I spend on things that I want to. So I just wanted to make that clear that I'm not trying to brag in any way. If you're going to leave, you know, a rude comment, if you haven't seen my videos or something, um, just know that I delete mean comments and I will probably block you if it's a rude comment because I don't want you seeing my videos if you're going to leave mean comments on my channel so that's my little disclaimer totally not trying to be mean um I'm sure all of you guys just want me to get into my haul because that's why you're here and I love hauls too so let's go ahead and get started so in no particular order um I will go ahead and get started with my clothing so first I'll show you guys my things from necessary clothing which this is a great great store that is only in New York it's oh my god it's amazing they have pretty decent prices and they have really really cute clothes. So I did get a fair amount of things because I love this store and I was looking forward to going so much. Okay, so I got this pair of kind of high-waisted shorts and they're a royal blue and then they have these red birds on them and I love these. These just caught my eye. Um, they have little pockets in front and I just think these would be so cute in the summertime. I just love the brightness of those. I also got this other pair of shorts which these are like a high-waisted lace short and in the back they have this gold zipper and they're all this ivory lace and and it looks so pretty with like a nice shirt tucked in and they just look really gorgeous and this, these are so unique so I definitely wanted to pick those up. Another pair of shorts I got was these and they're in navy blue and I don't know if you can tell but they have a bow right here at the front and some ivory polka dots and these are so cute. Again you wear them high waisted and these are adorable on and um, then I got a couple dresses. This first one, I think this is so like bright and fun. I love it. It's like magenta and then coral and it has this adorable little V neckline where it kind of like points up. I don't have any really um, dresses that have this kind of neckline and then in the back it just has a zipper. So this was so unique for me and it was only $26 which I feel like that's a really good you know price for a nice dress like this and I just think this will be so fun to wear to something in the summer. Um, I got another dress which I purely got for the beautiful color. It's this gorgeous mint blue green and it's just kind of like a whimsical little dress. I don't know. I think it's gorgeous and it's kind of long. It goes down about to your knees and it's just simple but very pretty and feminine looking. Um, and then I just got two more things. I got this shirt which this is like a button up acid wash kind of denim shirt and it's like a three quarter length sleeve and I didn't have, I don't have any denim shirts and I've been wanting one for a while so that is why I picked this up, sorry I don't know why I unbuttoned it, I think I tried it on but you can kind of see what it looks like there and then this last thing I got is this sheer top and I just love the colors of this, I think you cannot really find something like this um, a lot of places so it's this long sleeve and it's pink, blue, and purple. And sorry, it's kind of difficult to show you, but 
then the back is like purple. Like the sleeves are all different colors and I just, I love that. I think it's so unique and it's also like a high-low style, which I got a lot of high-low stuff because that's just all over the stores right now for spring. So I love that. So that is all I got from there. Then I will show you guys, we went to the store called Chill. And I wasn't in love with it, but I liked a few things, and I was so happy, though, because I did find something that I was looking for my whole trip, which is a high-low skirt, but one, I wanted one that wasn't too long in the back, just because I wanted one that was kind of like, um, I'll show you. Basically, it goes down to, like, your knee area, and then in the back, it goes down like this, but it's not, like, to the floor, which I like because I didn't want it to be super long, and it's just this pretty purple color. So this looks really gorgeous on, and um, I can't wait to show this in some kind of a video, an outfit of the day or something. That's all I got there. And then I will show you, we went to the pink store because I was looking specifically for, um, you can only get these pink, like, sweats that say like Pink Heart NYC or New York City um, in New York and I knew I wanted that so I went and I asked the lady and um, she showed me where they had this stuff so I just got the sweater because they had yoga pants with it not like regular sweatpants and I have a lot of yoga pants and I don't really need any right now so I got the um, the sweater which is just this black hoodie it's very plain in the front but then the back is super blinged out and it says love pink New York City and again you can only get these ones um, that say New York City and New York so it's like blinding my camera right now with all its bling but I love this and this was a bit of a splurge but you know because it's like bling and Victoria's Secret but I know I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this because it actually is a pretty like you know basic sweater and it will match with a lot of stuff and yeah so that is what I got from there. Next, I picked up a souvenir from um, FIT, which FIT is the Fashion Institute of Technology, which I toured there on Thursday, which is the first day that I went, and I actually wore this to school today. I just, um, I, they give you a little, like, discount to go to the, um, the store where they sell their, like, um, their apparel and stuff, so I picked out this hot pink sweatshirt that says Fashion Institute of Technology, and it's a hoodie, and then on the back, it has this circle that says FIT, which stands for Fashion Institute of Technology. FIT is their, um, like, you know, short version or whatever of it. But um, I did like it. I wasn't in love with it, but I think I could be in love with it. So I'm definitely, uh, like, looking there um, for some of you guys that were wondering. But, yes, I got that sweatshirt, and I wore this to school today. It was super comfy and cute. We went to Extaza. Which, last year I found so much stuff at Extaza. This year I just found, I think, um, I got like three things. So it wasn't as impressive this year. I really liked Necessary Clothing better. They have some similar things. But I did still find a few cute things. First I got this striped top. Um, and it has some pink. And then in the back it has um, a zipper. And I believe Christy told me this was called Peplum where it like goes out so hopefully I got that right if not I really apologize I'm not positive but yeah you can tell where it kind of goes out at the bottom and I just thought that was unique and pretty and then I got this little shirt this was on sale for I believe ten dollars and it's just this pink kind of um shrug thing that like goes over shirts and then it has a lace like little vest on top of it so yes this was on sale for ten dollars so that was a great deal and then I just got one last shirt um, because I just love the neonness of this and it's this neon yellow top and it's just three quarter length and you know basic but it's a nice sheer top it'll be really pretty in the summer and so I got that okay next I will show you a few things that I got at H&M I think I got um, what okay three things so that's not you know that's not that bad I, I did pretty good at H&M okay the first thing I got is this mint pair of shorts and I just got these because of the color I felt like I wouldn't be able to find these that many places for um, such a good deal they were $17.95 and they're just a basic short, but I really like these and the color. And then I got this dress, which I actually wore while I was there to dinner one night. So it has been worn, but it is this just floral basic dress. It has a three-quarter sleeve, and it goes down to here. So I just thought this was pretty, and I love the material. And it was only about $20, so it was a really great deal. And it's very pretty, and I cinched it in with a belt. And then the last thing I got is this skirt, and it's this coral 
like um, high waisted skirt and then it has a gold zipper in the back and I tried this on and it actually is too small for me didn't really fit over my butt so I don't know why um, hopefully I can find this when I go exchange it but I'm gonna have to either return or exchange this skirt so that's a disappointment because I think it's really pretty but hopefully I can find it and now this store is definitely the most damaged um, forever 21 yeah my bag is crazy filled because I went two times um, and got clothes because the Forever 21 Times Square, if you guys have ever been, it's four stories and it's huge. Each story is so big. It takes like hours to get through there, but it's amazing if you love Forever 21 like me. And I hadn't been to Forever 21 in a little while, so I definitely, you know, got um, a lot of stuff, but Forever 21 is one of my absolute favorite stores. So the first thing I got is actually kind of silly because it's not clothes, but it's so cute. And I saw this in their little pajama section. So it is this blue um, leopard. It's called a spa wrap. And you wear this when you get like out of the shower when you're like washing your face and getting ready and stuff. And then it came with this matching headband. Isn't this so cute? And this was like $15. So, um, I actually really need a new one of these. I have one from Victoria's Secret that has just been falling apart. It's in terrible condition, and this is so soft. So, I can't wait to use that. And then, the rest of the stuff in here I got is clothes. Alright, so I got this kind of white or ivory cropped denim jacket, which I think this is so cute like over dresses or something it'll just be nice to throw on and this was just a staple for me I don't have anything like that and I was kind of looking for um some jackets that were that color so I was very happy to find that I also picked up this romper which I love the burnt orange color of it and I absolutely adore rompers and it has a little tie here I think Aspen got this but I'm not sure or at least she tried it on but I ended up getting it I love it and um, I just love the color of that and then I got this pair of shorts because they I love the buttons on these just how they stand out and um, so I got those because I don't think I have any shorts that are really this color so that will match with a lot and then I got this basic sundress and it's just so cute to me it just screams like spring or summer to me it's just really basic but it was such a great deal I seriously think this was like um, this was $16 I thought it was actually cheaper than that but that's really adorable in my opinion I love that and then I got um, a lot of shirts. This one I got, sorry this stuff's kind of wrinkly. This is a high, kind of a high-low star shirt, which stars are apparently like in right now, and I don't have like anything stars, and I'm really attracted to them. So it's like black stars on the back, white, well, white on the front with black stars. Um, you know what I mean. So it's high-low, and I thought that was really cute. And then I got this dress, which I am so in love with this peachy color of this dress. I just think this is so unique and adorable. I can't get enough of dresses. I just feel so girly every time I wear them. They're my favorite thing to wear so I feel like I really cannot have enough dresses. I also got this skirt with polka dots and it's just brown and black and I just think that's so cute. I'm really into the polka dot. Not like, I guess it's kind of a trend. I'm really into the polka dots. Um, I got a few more polka dot things that you guys will see but also I'm really into these shirts that have the open shoulders and I don't really have any shirts like this so I got a couple and I also wanted a shirt that had this little tie front and I just think this is so unique and the colors are really bright and fun okay so then on to my second trip from Forever 21 I went two separate times so I didn't get all this stuff crazily in one day but um the next thing is a pair of high-waisted light wash denim shorts. I don't have any, I don't think, high-waisted denim shorts, which is so weird to me. So I was happy to find these, and they look so adorable on, and they were a great deal. They were about $16. And then um, my next thing is this dress, which personally I wasn't sure if I was going to like this because it's kind of weird looking, but it's so unique, and I actually love it. It has this um, neck that just goes across. And then it's just very simple, like you can belt it, but then the back has like this open cutout, and I just think that's gorgeous. And it was about um, $20, $19.80, which is so good for, you know, dresses. That's really great. And then um, I got another one of these open shoulder tops because this one was only $7. That's a great deal, and I love the coral color, so it's just a basic... Ah, it's hard to show you guys this, but you know what I'm talking about. 
just a basic shirt like that. This is another high-low shirt that I got, and it reminds me kind of a peppermint or a candy cane or something, but um, I love it, and also AK Doll Kayla got this, and I just love it, and I think that's so unique. And then I got this shirt, which personally, I really like this. I love the little collar and the bright, fun colors. It kind of reminds me of, like, the 80s. I don't know why I like the colors just do. And then it has a bow in the back, which this is just so girly. And I thought this would be adorable with the high-waisted shorts tucked in. And then I got this shirt. And it is a high-low kind of tunic top. And it's green polka dots. Again, you see me having more polka dots. And so that is a high-low, and I think this would be gorgeous over white skinny jeans, which I have yet to find. I need to find me some of those. Um, I got another high-low shirt, which this one's kind of extreme, but I, I love this for, like, over leggings or um, colored skinnies or something. It just has this pocket here, if you can even tell, and it's hot pink three-quarter sleeve. And as I said, it's an extreme high-low, but I love it. And all of this stuff was super expensive, so that's why I got super, what am I saying, super inexpensive. So that's why I got a lot of stuff, because you can just, I just love Forever 21, 21 you guys know. Okay, just a couple more things. I promise this wasn't all in one day. You guys know my obsession. So another polka dot item. And this is, um, it has this pink at the bottom. And this is actually so, it looked kind of boring to me. But this is beautiful on. It's gorgeous. And it reminds me of something that Sarah Jessica Parker wore in Sex in the City too. I was watching that on the plane there. And then I got this and I was like, oh my god. That reminds me of it. Okay, and then I got this shirt which is this white kind of crochet tank. This is like $10. It was such a great deal. Like, I can't pass up these just the such great deals that they have at Forever. And then my, okay, this was confusing. My last thing that I got was just this basic yellow dress. And it has this kind of um, crochet knit pattern. But then the back, it has a little bow, which I think that's adorable. And again, that was a really great deal. Whew, that was a lot of stuff. I realize it was, but you guys, I have not, I mean, I just, I have no excuse other than I'm a shopaholic and Forever 21 has amazing deals. It wasn't like that was all expensive, you know? So, um, then I just have two more stores. I'm almost done. Um, I have Buffalo Exchange, which I had never been before, and it's kind of like a hit or miss. Like, a lot of my friends didn't find anything, but I found, um three things that I really liked. My favorite thing that I found, this has never been worn. It's like a thrift kind of store, like it has stuff that's been worn before, but this has been ne never worn before, and it's this cute little pink dress with hearts on it, and then it's just so simple, but so girly and adorable, and um, I just thought that was so cute, and again, it's a brand new shirt. It's never been worn, and then I found this shirt from, originally from H&M, and it just looks like that, and it was like about $10, so I thought that was a, a good deal. I couldn't decide, but my friends were like, you know, it's $10, that's a good deal, so you should get it. And then this was like $5, and it's just this pretty yellow scarf with florals, and it just um, is really gorgeous and reminds me of like Easter colors, which Easter already passed, but um, it's still pretty for the spring and summertime. And then this isn't clothing, but from Urban Outfitters, I just went... And I got two pairs of shoes. I just thought I would include these in here because I didn't think they were, um, like, accessories, really. I just thought it went more with clothing. So I got two pairs of Toms. And my first pair is this gorgeous floral pair, which I first found these on spring break, but they didn't have my size. So I was so happy that Urban had my size. I wear a 7 in Toms. And I just think these will go with, like, jeans and, like, solid color shirts very well for the summertime. I just think those are so unique. And then um, my gray toms that I have probably worn like 300 times. I have worn them so much. They're disgusting. Like, I just can't wear them anymore. So I decided to get a pair of black basic ones that goes with everything to kind of replace those. And toms are just, they last so well. Like, they've never, like, broken on me or anything. And they're a really great shoe. And then if you buy a pair, they give a pair of toms to... Um, a kid in need that doesn't have shoes. So that's always great and that is all the clothing and two pairs of shoes that I got. So I know um, I got a lot of clothing as I said but I hope you guys will understand that I was in New York and I was shopping for like four or five days straight so obviously it's gonna add up when you like shop that much in a big city with tons of stores all around you but I do hope you guys enjoyed this and um, now I'm gonna go ahead and film the other parts. <coughs> Sorry my voice just like eh. 
it's making me go crazy, but um, that was the clothing part, so the other parts are coming up soon, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I will see you in the next parts of the video, and very soon in my next video. Bye, guys! <laughs>